I want to welcome you to uh, Metasoc tutorial in here and what I want to show you today is to how to check if your data that you have in Metasoc is the latest or not. Now first thing you have to do is look at your end of day data provided. Uh, most of you who have been to my workshop would know that uh, I subscribe to, uh, or I recommend you to subscribe to Telecode. Uh, which has one of the best and cleanest quality data for the KLC data. So this is what you want to do. Right, and first thing you want to do is to, uh, if you have subscribed to the Telecode data services for one year, you have a software called iCom 3.1 in here. Now to check uh, for the up to date, what you want to do is to make sure that the uh, you download it daily. Okay noted by here download daily this is the i download icon button and every day you'll see the actual data here right so the actual data here is uh last update that i have of course uh, today being the 7th of january i only updated on to the uh, 5th of january so i've got two more days to update you can see that is the actual date that i have now how do i know this is the actual date now we have to uh, switch over to metal stock i'll switch over to metal stock now okay this is my Metasoc data. Now, what you want to do is to check your data if it's up to date or not. Now, I do understand if you subscribe to Telecode and a day data, your data that you have is located. Now, let me repeat you how it's located. It's located at the C drive, right? C drive slash MS slash KLSC 3. So, how do you do that? Is first you want to uh, go up to File, okay, open. Now, then you need to look at your C drive in here. Okay, go up to C drive. Let's push it up. C drive. That's the C drive. Now, the next thing you want to do is look for the MS folder, which stands for Metasoft folder. Now, just scroll down here, click on this. Can you see the Metasoft folder? Now, click on that one. Right, then you get a bunch of uh, other files here. Okay, that will take a while. First, uh, there you go. Now, what I have, I have the Australian Forex Futures. Hong Kong Hang Seng Index and also the KLSC. The one that we're interested in is the KLSC 3. Now click on the KLSC 3. Now this is where you would see uh, the data that you have followed by symbol, name, daily, first date. Now this is the first date that the stock was uh, actually listed in the KLSC. Now very important to pay attention on the last date here. This is the last date and the last date is denoted by 5th of January. So that's how you would know this is the end of, of uh, the, uh, the the last date that you have on the uh, data. Okay, so it's January 5th. Yeah. Now, so what we want to do now is just to open any of these files. I'll probably look for, uh, let me see. Here, oh, okay, I, I spotted DRB Highcom. Okay, let me just go back up there. DRB Highcom. And you click on it. So the date that I have will be. Uh, last date will be the January 5th now and I uh, open this up there you go so that's and that's how you open up a file and detect that the date is last date is January the 5th now that will be the end of the Metasoc tutorial on how to know the last date of trading for your end of day thank you